Hey everyone, it's Desi Chang and the guys from 4Monster have sent me over some of their products. Uh, they're mostly just uh, outdoor travel goods. And uh, over here I have a four pack of microfiber towels as well as uh, two sports towels, uh, which you can use for the beach. Uh, I have two tiny, tiny backpacks, uh, stowable, packable uh, backpacks, perfect for traveling, uh, as well as two more um, other dry fast sports towels um, for you to use if you go to the gym, go hiking, um, anything like that. So let me kind of go through each one of the products and I'll like, kind of let you know uh, what I think of each one. So let's start off with this guy right here. So <clears throat> this is the biggest and the heaviest out of uh, the entire bunch here. Um, and what it is, is um, uh, they're just four bigger towels. I will open it up. <clears throat> And I'll kind of show you how each one is. I'll just whip one out. It looks like this in here. There's four towels. Um, so each one uh, comes with this uh, nice little button buckle, snap buckle. Uh, so you can nicely fold it up and stash it and put it away. And this is about how big it is. Okay, so fairly large. Um, it's not as thick as a regular bath towel, um, but it's definitely thinner than that. So, uh, you know, it's something that it would be great if you take to the beach, um, anything like that. Because, you know, having four towels in here uh, to fit in this small case uh, is much smaller than bringing out four regular size beach towels. Um, so, yeah, so overall, um, I mean, it's just a towel. The one thing, though, that I don't like about this product is that because of this uh, this specific microfiber cloth or whatever like that, you can kind of feel it um, catching onto your skin. Um, like, I don't know what it is, but it's just kind of a, a different type of a feeling. And I can feel like, uh, uh, you know, they're just like the small little cracks in my skin. You can kind of feel it just kind of, uh, you know, grasping onto it a little bit. It's, it's, like, it's like a different type of a feeling. Um, it's only on my hands though, so if you put it on like the other parts of your skin, it feels like just like a normal towel. Um, I don't have that same sensation with the other towels, only this one. Um, so yeah, that's just one thing to note. So I'll put this aside now. <coughs> and uh, put that away. Oh, it does also come with a, a little um, uh, a dry pouch here. So if you can just like stow one of the towels in here and take it to go. Boom. Okay. Next set of products here. Um, now these ones, I just actually came back from a, a trip to San Diego, California, and I took these two guys with me and uh, yeah, took them to the beach, took them to the pool. Um, they were great. I mean, it comes in this small little pouch. Uh, I love the pattern on it. It's, uh, you know, it's nice and funky and colorful. And when you open it up, it's similar to those ones, okay? It does have this little snap buckle, which you can use it to tie it closed, or you can use it to hang it on something. Uh, but yeah, when you open it up, it's just almost just as wide and big as the other one, um, but it's, it's large enough for you to lie on to the beach, on the, to the grass or anything like that. It's not as thick as the other one, um, but uh, yeah, I mean, it does the job. So that's that one. Um, and then put that aside. The other one is the same thing. I will open this up. <clears throat> and it's the exact same size, just different pattern and different color. <clears throat> boom and boom. It's fairly large. So put those aside now. Um, anything negative I have to say about it? Not really. I mean, it's uh, like, like I said, it's not as thick as your traditional uh, beach towel or anything like that. But for you to travel with something so small, um, it was great. It was, it was almost as if I, you know, didn't bring anything at all. So I would highly, highly recommend that if you're traveling and, and you want to bring a beach towel, uh, grab one of those guys. Uh, the next set of things, two other towels. Uh, this one is still in its full packaging because I didn't use this one, but the same thing as this one, but just two different colors. Um, and what this is, it's a sports towel. So uh, for those people that do yoga, go hiking, uh, things like that, uh, this is really, really nice and compact. It comes in this case, 
which is breathable because it has a ventilation uh, on either side. So once you're done using it, you can scrunch it up and put it back in here um, and it'll slightly air out. But I just squished it in here. So same sort of deal, it does have a buckle and you can hang it or do whatever. So they're not as large as the other towels, um, but it's just something nice that you can just kind of, you know, throw over your shoulder, uh, you know, wipe yourself if you're sweating or anything like that. Or if you have a baby, you can use it to, you know, dry the baby. Um, and yeah, and so the other thing I also wanted to show off was how absorbent this was. So I have a glass of water. I'm just gonna spill a little bit of water onto the table. Not a lot, but I think that's a fair amount. That's probably more than what a normal person would do to sweat. And yeah, we're just going to wipe it all up. So the one thing I will say though, is that it will not absorb as much as a regular towel, but that's for obvious reasons because this is just a small thin towel. Um, but after you do that, you know, wipe it, make sure all the surface area is covered and boom, I mean, it's, a, it's got a little bit of residual stuff, but you know, it did a pretty good job in soaking up that water that I just spilled onto the table. You could bring this out, hang this out, um, and yeah, that's essentially it for this towel. Lastly though, what I wanna show you guys, which I think is really, really cool, um, I brought this one to my trip. Uh, these are two different size backpacks. Uh, these are travel size backpacks that you can just, you know, shove into your suitcase, your luggage. Uh, and then whenever you arrive somewhere, if you wanted a small day pack, you can just erect these things. Um, so this one right here is a 24 liter backpack. And this one is, I think it's a 16 liter backpack. So I'll show you the size difference of both of them. So I took this one, I took the 24 liter one. And I was actually quite impressed that something so small could fit into this. Boom. You just literally just stash it away. So that this is it. This is essentially the backpack. Now, keep in mind, it's supposed to be a very, very lightweight backpack. So don't expect like sternum straps or anything like that or, or any kind of uh, uh, you know, foam padding. It's literally just something that you can just stow away the gear. So now the stash pocket that I originally had it in it's just uh, you know sewn onto the bag. So you just shove it back in there so you won't lose it. It has two large um, you know, pockets for your water bottle. So you can put it on either side. Um, and the other great thing about it is that it has weatherproof zippers. Boom. You don't see that in a lot of bags, um, only ex expensive bags. Um, but yeah, you have a one main weatherproof zipper at the very, very top which lets you access the interior of the bag. Um, inside, there's nothing fancy or anything about it, um, but also has one other weatherproof zipper at the front here for a small little stash pocket, which goes all the way down in here. I can put my entire hand in here. And uh, yeah, that's essentially it. I mean, it has uh, adjustable, you can adjust the straps here, but uh, that's essentially it for the 24 liter bag. Now let's take a look at the other one. So this one is the uh, 16 liter ones. Oh, I forgot to uh, mention, uh, it is also made of 30D nylon waterproof material. So if you are hiking into the rain, this will be totally fine and weatherproof. When I went to San Diego and I used it, it was not raining at all. So uh, I couldn't test the uh, waterproofness of it. So, uh, oh, and the other uh, great thing is that it is, they are YKK zippers. So those are the best zippers in the world. Uh, so you don't have to worry about your cheap zippers breaking down or anything like that. So here we go. I'm going to open this up. Boom. So this is just a different color, it's essentially exact same style. So I'm going to put this in here just so you don't get confused. And now these are the two sizes of backpacks. Okay. So boom and boom. So I'm about 5'9". Um, I think this is a little bit too small for me. I think this would be perfect for anyone who would be smaller than myself. Um, but uh, I, for me personally, I really liked the 24 liter one. Um, 
as opposed to the 16 liter one. But again, it just depends on how big you are and how much stuff you have to carry. Um, but uh, yeah. Anyways, so uh, yeah, these are the products from 4Monster. Uh, they sell a lot of different uh, outdoor gear, such as these sports towels and the backpacks. And they have other things uh, like a sleeping bag and other things like that. So uh, anyways, uh, based on the products that they've sent me so far, I feel like they're, they're made of high quality. Uh, they're very useful, compact, lightweight, uh, easy to travel with. So I would highly recommend those. So if you like this review and you want to see me do more of these, like and subscribe and definitely don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Desi31. Thanks for watching.